our writing to officially warn you, Jesse Dewart threatens top ANC member. Lamani Chalk, the organizer of the ANC Break Common Board in Northwest, has been undermined with suspension by ANC Delegate Secretary General Jesse Dewart in the event that he keeps on opposing requests from Lothaly House. It hosts to do with the gatherings up and come a list strategy being tidied up. Taking into account this, Dewart kept in touch with Chalk on Monday saying, Dot, I'm writing to formally caution you that in case there are additional disasters, distortion, or an ability to follow rules, we will have no real option except to suspend you as IPC organizer of the Northwest. Notwithstanding, apparently Chalk will be rebuffed twice for a similar offense, as Stewart composed a different letter to ANC public chief panel deployees in Northwest around the same time, mentioning that they meet and direct an intensive appraisal of Chalk appropriatenesses to proceed in his job as facilitator of the Northwest Break Common Advisory Group. Quote, Dewart should get ideas from the deployees. There gives off an impression of being a shot at the ANC being blamed for twofold danger on the grounds that Dewart gave Chalk an admonition letter, a disciplinary advance, while additionally dispatching an examination concerning his skill to hold office, all coming from a similar offense. Chalk was the subject of a grumbling over a letter he shipped off ANC structures in the Northwest last Thursday, which was viewed as a mutilation of a gathering the day preceding with the party's discretionary board, which was driven by previous delegate President Gleema Motland. Because of time limitations, the constituent board chose not to hold a real run of the applicant determination measure, as per the letter. As indicated by Chalk, the area needed to follow public methods and present its last applicant list on Saturday. After the 2021 nearby government races, all annoying issues will be settled, he said. Following that, Motland announced Chalk to the ANC's best six for creating turmoil about the situation with the area's applicant choice interaction which had public repercussions on the grounds that numerous different territories were likewise enduring with the issue. During a gathering of the IPC with the NEC deployees to the area, the head of the ANC NEC, Obapella, was recorded contradicting the substance of Chalk's letter, which seemed online last week. The Political Race Board of Trustees not even once demonstrated that the cycles are shut. Quote, Appella is heard expressing, what they said, is reliable with what was communicated at the NEC meeting. In case somebody were eliminated from the rundown yet assigned by their networks, if this has happened any place in the territory, all areas should explore, quote, he added. Also, if proof recommends that some unacceptable up-and-comer was taken out, we should eliminate that competitor and re-establish the person in question. We need to do reruns when there are reruns to be finished. The IPC organizer's letter is wrong, and it doesn't address the public rundown board of trustees, quote, he expressed. That ought to be eliminated with prompt impact, he said, adding that the ANC was a solitary association. We are not, and have never been, a government association. Also, if such a letter exists, I ask this IPC to reject and eliminate it promptly, so the organizer can deliver a letter, as per the NEC choice and rules. Quote, he guaranteed he was chipping away at altering, redressing, anything we have documented where there are protests. At least 19 wards across the territory still can't seem to assemble local gatherings to choose up-and-comers starting last week. Following a 30-minute conversation, Appella asserted Motlanth was asking with the territory to make the best choice. In the event that Northwest will not do as such, he suggests that the IPC be disbanded. Doing as such is the most exceedingly awful sort of sick discipline, and any territory that does as such will be exposed to a similar suggestion. Dot, please like, comment, share and follow this channel for more information, or updates on news and entertainment.